He fires it up, it is good. Pull it back to the ring and win. A step back, three point shot. Got it! Unbelievable! Well, I, I can't really explain to you. First of all, I'm exhausted. Um, it's been a tremendous three weeks and um, really excited about, you know, it's just, it's just an unbelievable feeling to, uh, to, see what's, to see what's happened in the gym and to see these guys come and, and, and really just tough that game out, uh, you know. We, we weren't, we, I don't think we were playing great and um, we were just able to, uh, just to stick with it and uh, it's a credit to the guys and I'm really happy that we were able to, to do it in, in, in front of the home crowd. So, you know, I'm, just, I, I'm really speechless right now. I thought we were playing too hard. I thought we were playing, I thought we wanted it too much, to be honest with you. I thought we were trying, we were not playing our game. We were playing at a pace that uh, was frantic rather than fast. And uh, I said at one point with eight minutes to go, like, this is not the way we play. Stop and calm down. But you know, we made some huge effort plays. Tim made some huge steals at such an important time. And you know, I thought we were able to sort of clean up some of the issues on the glass at the in the second half. There, uh, that, you know, we were able to at least even it out. And then, uh, you know, we made some we made some big plays. We executed at the right times, and we were able to get some stops at the right times. And at this time of year. I think that's what this is all about. You know, I think that's what these guys are learning now. It's not so much uh, what offense and defense you run. It's about making plays at the right time, and it's about doing things and executing at the right time. For us to, to think about a championship before the season, it's a, you, you can't really. That's just too big a goal because it's overwhelming. If you if you just think, well, we got to win a championship, and that's what you base your success on, you can't do that now because we're not in the lead. So. Um, to be given an opportunity by the College Insider Tournament, and if, and we deserve the opportunity, by the way, but to be given the opportunity by a, a postseason tournament like CIT, and to have this opportunity, there's not a, there's, there's no money price you can put on it because these kids have learned something that, uh, you know, as an independent, you wouldn't normally get. So, you know, I told them in practice yesterday, this is not a, we're almost getting used to it now. You, you know, this we got to keep our edge, and we got to continue to, uh, we got to continue to embrace it, and we talked about. Next play, that was a big thing we were talking about today. I thought we did a good job with that. Uh, we continued to stay in the moment, and we went to the next play. And uh, So just the maturity, the, the, how far we've come from a maturity standpoint is really pretty impressive. And, you know, I, I can still I can look back at some of the games I've coached and, and see, the, see when a bat and when a ball goes in and you win a big game and you see the joy and you see, you see, you get the feeling of what's out there. It's, uh, again, it's priceless. And, um, you know, now we're used to it, you know, so I, I think it's great. You know, now it's an expectation. Now, we, now I'm going to put some pressure on the fans to continue to come back for every game. Uh, so it's, it's been unbelievable, and it shows the potential of our university. It shows the potential of what this school can be. You know, I don't know why we can't get in the league right now, but uh, like I said, you know, come and, see, come and see a game at NJIT. And, you know, I've been in a lot of gyms this year, and I haven't seen a lot of atmospheres like that, you know, so... Uh, all the credit to the student athletes here and all the credit to the, to the, to the administration and all the students here. It's been unbelievable.